So you want to be a data scientist. That's awesome. That's a great career choice. So congratulations. But before you start jumping right into it, I think you should take some time of planning what you should learn, how you should learn it, and in how much detail. So in this short video, I will be explaining to you my suggestions of how you should plan your learning efforts. So as I said, this is a short video of me explaining my suggestions on a high level, but if you want the whole experience, if you want to read all of my suggestions, go and check out my course, Data Science Kickstarter. It's on my website and it's actually for free, so you can just take it without any charge. I will be leaving the link in the description. All right, so the first thing, number one thing is first, you actually have to decide what kind of data career you wanna get into. Okay, I started the video saying you want to be a data scientist, but sometimes people are not really sure. I've even seen people who said they want to be data scientists, but it turned out they want to be product analysts, for example, that's a very different uh, line of work. Um, but actually, I think we can just collect all these different data type of works, or I call them data professions, into three different levels. So we have data engineers, we have data analysts and we have data scientists. So how are these different and how can you decide what you want to be? So my first suggestion is actually first before you learn about what these things are, go and write down on a piece of paper what you see yourself doing, what you want to be doing at your work, what would make you happy. And once you're done with this, uh, come here and listen or go on my course and read what these professions are. So data analyst is someone who will be working with data again uh, as a data scientist, but they will not be using the data to create predictive systems. So they will maybe be dashboarding, they will extract insights from the data set, and they will mostly be working with data to use it immediately. But when you look at a data scientist, it's a little bit different. Data scientist has an overall goal. Uh, let's say it's, you know, you're trying to predict some sort of thing or some sort of customer behavior, for example, and you're using data as a tool. So data is not your goal in that sense. It's more of a tool that you're using. So you might be using different uh, data sets, for example. And a data scientist will be using some advanced techniques like machine learning or in general, predictive analysis to uh, generate some results. So that's the main difference between data analysts and data scientists. Data analysts mostly just use data as a goal and try to extract insights from it, try to get some information from it. Whereas data scientists put another la layer on top of this and try to do some predictive analysis and use the data or a multiple sources of data to reach a goal. And we also have data engineers, as I said, and data engineers are more people who are on the background of things or backstage of things. They're trying to set systems in place so that data analysts and data scientists will be able to reach data sets and use them. And also at the end, they will, after data analysts or data scientists create some sort of program that needs to be run, let's say every day or every week, data engineers will be the ones who to, uh, to deploy this. It's not always the case. Sometimes those people are called machine learning engineers. So it's, but it's still more on the engineering side of things. So kind, kind of, you know, how can the data be collected? How can it be used efficiently? And how can it be deployed in a system so it will reach to the end user? So it's a little bit more technical work. Uh, if we need to, you know, put them in a, a line of like which one is more technical, I guess data engineering would be more technical than data science and data analyst. But one thing that you should keep in mind in this is these titles change quite a lot from company to company. So maybe in one company you will be called a data analyst, you will still be doing machine learning things. And uh, yeah, you'll be working very heavily with latest technology on that uh, front and with AI and everything. But on another company, maybe you'll be called a data scientist, but you wouldn't even be working with machine learning, you would be doing dashboarding or creating some simple charts. So do not let the titles fool you. Uh, this is just kind of for you to have a more clarity on what kind of position that you want. Is it more technical? Do you want to be on the background of things? Uh, or is it a little bit more kind of soft skills focused? And you want to be a data analyst and you want to um, convey the message of the data to uh, the managers or the people or the decision makers. Uh, so that's the first decision that you need to make before you jump into learning data skills.